Before we begin the course, this video is for those interested in the Practical Network Penetration Tester Certification, or the PMPT. This is for those interested or already taking the certification training. This is a quick overview of the training that you should take in which order you should take it in order to be most successful on your exam. So the PMPT exam is a five day exam and there are two additional days to write the report, meaning you have a full five days to perform your assessment. Then you have an additional two days to write your report. You'll submit your report and then you have a 15 minute debrief that you have to perform in front of us in order to achieve the exam. Now the exam does require open source intelligence, external penetration testing skills and active directory penetration testing skills taught in the course are those skills. Now you are starting with the practical ethical hacking. This is the place to be. This is the foundation that builds upon everything else for your training. So here is the practical ethical hacking course. That is training option. Number one, go ahead and complete this course first before you consider moving on to anything else. The other two courses that are considered mandatory for this certification are the open source intelligence or OSINT fundamentals course and the external pen test playbook course. You need OSINT, you need external pen test skill set, you need active directory skill set, which is taught in the practical ethical hacking course combined in order to pass this exam. Now we also have the Windows and Linux privilege escalation courses. If you purchase the with training option, you get these. These trainings are optional though you can find benefit from them and from the tactics listed within the courses that may show up on the exam as well. Though we assure that these three courses here are uh, what you need for the foundational skill sets in order to, to pass the exam. These two here are currently optional. So with that out of the way, if you're taking the exam, good luck on the exam. I hope to see you certified very soon. Also provide information down below, basically a summary of what I just said. So with that being said, now let's move on to the course.